I'm honored to present this award to such a talented group of truly wonderful actresses. And here are the nominees for Best Actress in a Motion Picture Comedy. Jamie Lee Curtis for Freaky Friday. Scarlett Johansson for Lost in Translation. Diane Keaton for Something's Gotta Give. Diane Lane for Under the Tuscan Sun. And Helen Mirren for Calendar Girls. And the Golden Globe goes to, goes to, oh, I love this, Diane Keaton. Oh my God, okay, all right. I'll hold it for Thank you. <laughs> Um, I sure as hell wasn't prepared to be rediscovered by Nancy Myers. <laughs> Let's face it, getting to play a woman to love at 57 is like reaching for the stars with the stepladder. But I know I got lucky, and isn't it ironic that my luck, all my luck, was to have Nancy give me a chance to play a woman to love one more bittersweet time. When Nancy opened that door, I crept through to find Jack Nicholson waiting for me on the other side. <laughs> oh my God. Without the insane Irishman throwing me curveballs, I couldn't have reached for anything much less stars. Amy Pascal, the head of Sony Pictures, Amy made it all possible by putting her money where her mouth was. Amy's green light created an unlikely alliance between Nancy, genius Jack, and me, the rediscovered eccentric. <laughs> With hope as our light at the end of the tunnel, we made our unlikely alliance work in the name of love at any age. So, Yeah. Anyway, so my dear members of the Hollywood Foreign Press, I thank you not only for making me so happy at a time in my life when this kind of honor just isn't in the cards, but also for shining light on the brilliance of Frances McDormand, Keanu Reeves, Amanda Peet, the rest of the cast and crew, and the content of Something's Gotta Give, a romantic comedy starring Jack, <laughs> and Diane, two people whose combined age is 125. 